Hi, hello. Um, today's a video is about recap of the my electric pipe bike. That's what I call it. It's more like a low low rider, and this is an electric bike. It's made from the idea, not just me yet, because I made from the pipe. It's not strong. Yeah, it's not strong, but this is a prototype and I want to get the idea going fast so I cannot get the pipe bending machine or get the uh, someone to bend or the connection for me according to my design. But here was I have, you know, and I go around it for and um, design. And because of this, uh, become is more like uh, easy rider and you see the seat is more like you know regular seat like a tractor seat something like that but I want to make this more like you know easy to ride this is more like a training wheel but it's like um, a landing gear for a regular uh, airplane stuff like that but I get this from the uh, handicapped people like uh, they have the bike and they want to ride the motorcycle but they cannot have the leg the uh, you know and that is made from the automatics uh, system use the GPS system well okay let's get started I want to start the system okay I start and uh, power is up and this is more like a you know the old school yeah 12 one this play the red one here is it's just for the reverse you don't need to lap the foot to the ground and this is a GPS working so I want to turn it on and see how it's off and on again see this is GPS speedometer and and um, this is a switch to control manual this is auto and manual switch this is auto this is manual so I want to lift this one off the ground and I want to show you uh, this video is going to be a little bit long so pay attention <laughs> okay and this is uh, going up so I want the going up is just like this it's good enough because I have the uh, limit switch right there and then I want to go for the uh, automatic function let's go to this one and I oops sorry and I go to automatic function it's like this one turn it on stop it's kind of cool and the GPS will control um, for five kilometer per hours speed to activate the the wheels up you know I try to set for 15 it's kind of like fast too fast so and I left up the wheel so you guys can see it when the wheel is spinning <sighs> Sounds good, right? Yeah. Well, the first design I want to, I don't want to intend to get that fast, but I put the uh, QS motor, 1000 watt, 72 won. It's become uh, very uh, strong because I put the uh, ratio on the uh, sprocket here. It's a 60. Uh, the teeth is 60 in front is uh, 11 so ratio is about 11 per 60 is like a 1 to 6 stuff like that so it quite you know very kick it up for the top that very high and and this is a easy rider you can you don't need to let the foot to the ground and just go for it and and I use the uh, the QS motor and underneath here is the QS motor and the, no, sorry. 
down here is a QS 1000 watt and the controller is a Wotol EM50 you can program by use a USB to the PC and here is the, my you know it's more like a cockpit for but I put the theme like 1980 style but, but that that time it doesn't have LCD here so let's show you the uh, total one that is about 80 so I have the uh, battery pack is here it's uh, 20 uh, 20 m um, 24 s and this is a uh, emergency it stop just in case like the bike is run away or you know the the throttle is like air or something just running cannot stop just press, press that one so and this is um, the uh, the driver for the the actuator motor here and I use the uh, actuator which is um, the maximum the length here is four four inch design but it's too when I order from China they send me five inch so I got no choice so I have to make it all stop uh, right here with the switch and uh, one of the diode one N four zero zero one so it's going down going up and the speed is like 40 po 42 millimeter per second which is the fastest one for actual mirror and the rest is more like a bite the first uh, the fuck here the chop is about 30 30 min millimeters and and uh, mini bytes and I put the uh, the LED for the uh, the see very strong LED not bad huh and right here the back here is the you know the back the brake light kind of fit perfectly now let me show you not bad huh ah, see when it turn it on is it's a tail light kind of cool and the other one is uh this one is uh for okay for the what for the reverse yeah say the wheel is reverse it off and you can go forward. Not bad, huh? Well, it, it's a design, you know, prototype, but I can't believe it's running so smooth. And uh, I will insert the, uh, the the clip for the test ride behind this video. But actually, it's my it's kind of perfect for me to to build this one. I love it, basically. And this is I proud of it because I make my own frame from the idea, from the drawing board. And don't judge me yet because I'm gonna start to you know uh, take it off, reconstruction everything, uh, take it out, and. Um, start to welding all around and make it more stable and then I'm gonna send to the exhaust the shop to make the uh, two inch pipe bending according to the frame prototype which is um, not bad you know and it's about that anything else I think should be okay and I want I don't want to get the video that too long. So 10 minutes it should be fast enough. Alright then. And um thank you for watching and um I hope you guys enjoy my design. And I hope someday um people are gonna love it. Thank you and you guys have a nice day. Bye bye.